Hey, 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 what's going on, guys? It's time! Like, it's more Madden NFL 15. Alright, so we're continuing my career in the NFL. This is game six. And we're undefeated still. Now, I looked at the schedule. We don't really have anyone that tough that we're playing. Um, I think we might play the Colts, so that might be the only tough one, maybe. The playoffs is the important part. But, I'm not going to redo anything, or any games, or go back in the settings, or touch it. So, play it how it is. <clears throat> Obviously, yeah, I want to win every game, but I'll be okay with losing some. To make it, uh... More realistic. Now, I'm not gonna try to lose. Because if it happens, it happens. If I win every game every year, that might actually get a little bit boring. Hello, everyone. I'm Larry Ridley, and this is the NFL on EA Sports. In today's matchup, we've got a pair of wide receivers who certainly want to be targeted throughout the game. It's the Jaguars going up against the Browns. Now we'll go down to Jim Nance and Phil Sims for this Week 7 matchup. Browns and Jaguars coming up here on EA Sports as we're getting set for today's Week 7 matchup. Hello, friends. Jim Nance alongside Phil Sims. And I guess the big question, Phil, before kickoff is what do you expect here today? You know, Jim, I expect these coaches to be aggressive. You can't go out here and just hope the other team makes mistakes. you got to go out there and take it. So do it with your play calling. You know, try some trick plays. Do whatever you have to do to give your team the edge. are ready to run back this kick. The best team in the AFC will be kicking off to get this game started. Let's go. All right. I don't know if I really like this play, but we'll go with it. The oh, the there we go. Charging ahead. And that's a gain of 10. Bill, let's keep our eye on the defense. If they keep giving up runs like this, they're going to have to change what they're doing. All right, coach, let's go for it. Maybe bring another guy. So, we're 5-0. Oh. I'm doing better and better. I haven't thrown a pick in a little while. <laughs> Just watch as I say that is going to happen, right? The Browns have it at the 44. Play action. Uh, wow. Speaking of which, I can't believe my guy didn't even try to try to fight it. Out of the University of just stood there. Quarterback Chad Henney. Chad Henney showed a lot of people in 2013 with the Jacksonville. I mean, I don't know what the hell they're doing. You let the defender oh, run up from behind you and basically make you look like an idiot. Thanks for nothing. The Browns will take the snap from the 45. Here's the handoff. Had a All right. That Moron. The play right there. Nice run that time. When you run the football like this, over wow. a period of time, it's going to wear that defense out. There's no doubt about it. Nice job by the offensive line. Let's go. Second down and five. Takes hand at the football. Oh! Oh! Awesome. Awesome. Terrific. The Browns offensive line is just whooping some tail today, aren't they? What a job up front. That helps the running back get in space. Get down <laughs> whooping there. some tail. That's one way to put it, Phil. The offense back to the line of scrimmage after going for more than 40 yards on the previous play. All right. There we go. Maybe five. Brown's offensive coordinator does a good job that time calling the pass down here in the red zone. Caught the defense off guard. They got the completion for a good game. 
Let's go. Offense lines up here. Second and goal from the four. Force it across. Why is that guy there? I don't care about you, Lewis. Good job that time by the offense. Um, okay. Whatever. Score is a score. Is Tater. Where is he? Is he hurt? A tire? Corners formation here for the defense. Oh! Shrugs off the first hit. The Browns now move the chains. Lewis is going to be tired. At Close save. That is hmm. a good long run. The offensive line was terrific. And yeah, where is it? Good job finding a hole and picking up those yards. Maybe he's pooped out from kicking butt already. Now first and ten. Throwing now to his left. Throw it to the outside. Oh boy. He must be all good if if he's taking his head. Thank you. All right. Let's go. And of course, plenty of pink on the Gotta shake off that pick in my mind and keep on going. All of October, we'll be seeing this for Breast Cancer Awareness Month. Oh, nice one. Stupid. Well, he dropped the football. There's no doubt why he dropped it. You have to look it in. Uh, oh, idiot. Second down after the incompletion. Let's go. There we go. Tate's back. Now as a slot receiver, the handoff to Ben Tate, right side. Oh! Stiff arms to stay on his feet. Taken down, just two yards short of the first. Sweet, sweet, sweet. What that run does, it just puts the offense in a good situation. So a good, positive run. I don't know. Let's see how it looks. Heading to the line for a third down play, and this was something they specialized in last week. Converting in these situations. All right, coach. We'll go with what you say. Third and three. Here's the handoff, and they'll run. There we go. There we go. All right, good call. Lewis is going to go back after this play and give his offensive line a little pat on the rear end and say good job. Third and short. They gave him the opportunity to get in there and pick up that first. There we go. Perfect. Gordon taken down. Hard to throw the football down the field once you get into the red zone. That time the quarterback, well, he knows that. And he looks down there. Nobody open deep. Throws it short. And they get a nice solid pickup on that play call. Tate's got it on the handoff. He's All right. First down by the offense in the red zone. And, you know, if you're on the defensive side. You don't have to worry about deep passes anymore. You can be more aggressive and take some chances. Let's try a quick slam. First Let's down see. here after the run. See if we've got an opening or not. Um. Quick drop back. No, wrong button. Oh my god. Almost picked off that time. Well, Jim, I threw a lot of passes. Oh, uh, did not mean to throw that one. And the guy dropped it. You just go, yes. I got wow. it. Wow. Now can you capitalize on this break? Second down coming up. Wow. Why did not mean to throw that? Takes it from the gun. Oh, my goodness. Almost intercepted. It's third and goal right here in a close game. This offense, they want to take control. If they score right here. Third and goal, and you run behind the linebacker. Okay, then. I don't know about that. Stepping up to the line at the four-yard line. Third and goal, okay. The defense comes out in the nickel. I thought it was fourth down. Third and goal at the four. There we go. All right. I was going to say, tell me going on fourth. Uh, that's not well, that bad of a call, now but able to go out there and drive a little risky, especially this early touchdown. in the game. This chase. All right, let's go. Marching down the field and taking their time, and now on first down, go there we go. Air. Run. 
Oh! Cleveland Browns. Yeah, boy! Cleveland, Cleveland, Cleveland. Never be satisfied in the NFL. Suck on that. Players are just too good. So when you get a chance to score, even though you're leading, take advantage of it. Awesome job by the coordinator on those play calls. Oh, yeah. That's what we want. Yeah, 59 yard touchdown pass. All right. Offense lines up here. Let's go. The, the handoff to Ben Tate. All right. It's there to take him down. And we knew, talking with both teams, how much the running game would be a focus today, and for good reason. Here's a running back doing tremendous things out there, as he has all year long. I think that's what's really incredible, and it both teams do exactly okay. what they wanted to do. The offense says we want to run it. The defense says we got to stop it. And how about there we go. The offense, once again, overpowering the defense. Number 19. You know, when you throw the football like that down the field, you pick up a first down. Now you can do anything you want on the offensive side, and you got that defense guessing. The Jaguars with a nickel look here on defense. Looking to go up top again on first down. Finds Burleson. And there we go. Gain of 13. Anytime you picked up a couple first downs, here's what happens. The defense starts to doubt what they're doing, but maybe more importantly, it gets those big boys over there tired. <laughs> goal from the 10. Eyeing that left side. That's something. Oh, then. Oh. You got to be agile when you make these kind of catches. What are these short drag routes across the field? That time we saw the agility of the receiver. Nice catch. Second and goal from the 7. He'll throw there we go. The margin is increased with another touchdown. All right. You want to make your coach happy? Have the lead and have your offense just keep pushing the football down the field and score and increase that lead. Let's see. What should we do this time? was able to recover the ball. Hmm, I don't know if that was a fumble, but all right. Nice job by the offense that time, even though they fumbled the football quick enough and smart enough to get on it right away. The offense is set all right. the line for the first down after that completion. An extra tight end on the field for this one. Lewis is going to take the handoff now. And he's brought down. Lewis is getting a little bit of yards today. That's not bad. Power running play that time by the offense. It picked up some good yards. Nothing like it. Show the defense you're willing to get in there and slug it out and get some tough running yards. Let's go. Offense lines up here. Dropping back three. Austin oh, Rex. First down. And now seeing these first half numbers, we knew coming into the game it was a possibility because this is one of the better passing attacks in the entire NFL, Phil. Absolutely. It's one of the better ones in the NFL. That's how they have built this football team, Jim. It's about the quarterback, the wide receivers doing it through the air. And if they want to win games, that's how they have to get it done. Uh, let's see. The Browns have it at the 34. Throws the pass. Wharton taking Sweet, down. sweet, sweet. Well, once again, the offense is in the red zone. They got a big lead. I think it's up to this defense. Finally show a little toughness and try to stop them for once. And now we reach the two-minute warning here in the second quarter. Coming up at halftime, please stay tuned for the Verizon Halftime Report. Presented by EA Sports. 
Let's go. And we're coming out of the two-minute warning in the first half. All right. Hey! They'll go shotgun here. Finds Burleson. Oh, almost. 13. Tim, when you get down the red zone, you have to be very careful as a quarterback not to turn the football over. Good decision that time by the quarterback. Gets the completion, and they get a nice, solid pickup that time. Goal line defense on the field. First and goal. Woo! Wow. Four again here to pad the lead. Jaguars. <laughs> You got to give the offensive line just a lot of credit. It's first and goal. They just line up and power the football. All right. Offense lines up here. The handoff to Ben Tate. Man, if he had broken that free, that would have been crazy. Signal for the timeout. And that's the first one they've used. I want to see if I can get a field goal out of this. The Jaguars come out in the nickel. Out of the shotgun. He's looking to the right here. Or that happens. And he's intercepted. He's brought to a hole. That was stupid of me. Oh well. My deep accuracy is not that good yet. The third quarter begins with this play. And picks up maybe three or four. Now as we look at these highlights, it's just been a highlight reel of great throws by the quarterback. Yeah, we're seeing it all, aren't we? We're seeing the And stupid ones on my part for interceptions. One's great touch, good decisions, right. off balance, you name it. This quarterback has done it today. Finds Burleson. Oh man. Turf. It takes really good corners to play a defense where you challenge the wide receivers and just play them man-to-man -man coverage. I don't think this defense has that kind of quality corner. They're going back up top. Has Cameron. Gains 12. Okay. This is an awesome job by the head coach, the offensive coordinator, and the offense. Just keep picking up those first downs. You got a big lead here in the second half. Keep that clock running. Let's go. Back to the air here on first down. Looking to the right side. There we go. Austin's got it. And a first. All right. That's an awesome job by the offense picking up this first down here in the second half. They've got a big lead. It's not about scoring anymore. It's just about milking that clock. And that is an art, and this team is good at it. Let's go. First down and 10. Tate's taking the handoff. Awesome. He's there to make the stop. Just about 100 yards right there. It's in the red zone. This defense has been awful all day long. Can they, can they bow their necks a little and show a little toughness? And maybe stop them this time. Let's go. Break the Second down, four to go. Looking across the middle. There we go. The catch and the first. The catch, the catch is made for the first. Step. Always a good job to pick up some yards when you're in the red zone. Nice throw by the quarterback, and he gets the completion. First down sweet, here sweet, 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 sweet. Completion. All right. Offense lines up here. Staying with the passing game. Wow. That's a ball. Nice one. Nice one. Nice situation here for the offense. The football game. Now they're in the red zone. Let's see if they come up with a play that fools the defense. They got to do at least one run. That one. So second down here. The give. Out of the eye, shakes off the hit. All right, all right. To the ground. It's getting harder and harder in the NFL to score when you're this close to the goal line. So what will the offense do? 
They, they better be creative. That's all I know. That's all you know, Phil. Stepping up to the three-yard line. Let's go. Third and goal at the three. Oh, boy. You don't step into it. You just stand there and let him run up behind you. Good job. Good job. What will the offense do? I'm sure the defense is hoping they go for it. There we go. The kick is good. Well, okay then. Mounting a serious drive. Has Gordon. That's a gain of 10. The key to being a star wide out in this league is showing up every week. And that's been the case here. Two straight huge games, partner. Well, he shows up every week. Look, hmm. he has the talent to be a star in the NFL, and he loves it. He likes being on that stage, and he gets it done. There you go. In on the stop and take a look at the numbers, and you can see the difference here, by and large, has come down to the passing attack. It has. They, I think the coaches realized early the quarterback was hot. So what did they do? They kept giving him the football, and he kept moving it down the field. Hurt. First and ten. The handoff to Ben Tate. And that game's won. Got to give a lot of credit to the defense. They were all over the run that time, and they only give up a short game. It's now second down. All right. Defensive backs out on the field for this one. He'll stand back beyond the center in the gun. You need to work on your catching. That time as he threw it short. Look, come on. Coverage one. The quarterback had to make a perfect throw. He didn't. Incomplete pass. It's Tate in the backfield. Drop back. Shotgun formation. What are you doing? You got to jump for the ball! What are you doing? Come on! I can't do any more than throw the ball to you. What a retard. Look. Doesn't even try. Doesn't even jump. Doesn't even jump. Unbelievable. Tate's lined up. What an idiot. Back formation. <sighs> Final quarter underway now with this snap. An open lane muscles through the defender. What an idiot. At least jump and give me the benefit of the doubt that you're trying. My gosh. The chains after that last run. <sighs> Here they come, back to the line after picking up over 20 yards on that last play. That's a gain of seven. Looking ahead, the Jaguars will be playing at home next week, while the Browns will also be playing at home next week. After the pass play, gain seven. Second and three on the way. The handoff to Ben Tate. Wow, nice. Behind the line. Hey, that's a great job by the defense. What an effort and what speed. That time they get in the backfield and tackle the runner for a loss. What an idiot. Third down. Let's go. Two, and five. Two, and five. He'll throw it over the middle. All right. The Browns get a first down. Being a go-to target, Phil, I think you would say every quarterback needs one. In fact, one just like this guy. Well, I know this. They need one. I know they all want one. And as a wide receiver, some guys, it doesn't matter if you double-team him every single play. They just have the knack and the talent to find a way to get over. You see the matchup at running back, and while only one side has really been able to count on that run game, it's still a very All right. close game. Yeah, it is, Jim. Close game here, and also that can happen when you talk about run games. They're going to go up and down, and if you're having trouble running the football, then change the direction of your offense. Do something else. Gets there we go. 
Ryan on the play. This offense has been moving the football all day long. Once again in the red zone, they have a big lead. What will they do? I think they'll just try to run it in from here. They're telling me to uh, throw it, so that's what I'm going to do. We'll send it back to the quarterback out of the gun. Nice one. The hit jarred the ball loose. Jim, the offensive coordinator, has done a terrific job so far here today. He's got his team winning. They're in the red zone. Let's see how clever he's going to be on this call. The Jaguars with two extra defensive backs in the dime. Second down and ten. To the right. Now the play is supposed to cut inside between some of the linemen, and you run to the out. I don't know what you're trying to do. Big lead. That's not the play. Finally, show a little toughness and try to stop them for once. All right. The tapes lined up directly behind the quarterback here. Third down and eight. Has his man. This time, they failed to pick up the first on third down. I thought I was going to run deeper than that. Today. When you can't hit the quarterback or put pressure on him, there's not much you're going to get done then. That time, quarterback had time, throws it down the field for another completion. Should be what we call a giving. Right. And he puts it through for three. Well, even though they get the field goal that time, it's still disappointing. You get in that position, you'd like to. Okay. This has been a long drive so far. That is bad play call. Play after play after play here on this drive. Just a quick drop back. Throws the pass. There we go. They bring him down at the 29-yard line. When you play a cover three defense, you protect against the deep pass. All right, let's go. All the underneath stuff is wide open, and the quarterback is taking advantage of that. Burleson's in the slot. Get ready. Get ready. Snap it out of the gun. He hauls it in, and the tackle is made right around the 39-yard line. What's the old expression? With two-minute warning. That's what they did with that throw and catch that time, right. Tim. It also gives them a chance for three more downs. Two minutes to go in the second half. Yeah, I want to try to get, like, 300 yards passing <sighs> each game. They'll go with the extra tonnage here with the jumbo set. And he takes off. That was a stupid throw on my part. Wow, I'm an idiot. I'm an idiot. Oh, my God. The tackle was made. I. What is the button to throw it away? I'm an idiot. We're destroying them, and I'm doing stupid throws. It's Tate in the backfield. First and ten. The handoff to Ben Tate. Then picks up a bounce. Wow. <sighs> so stupid of me. And here we have. What is the throwaway hand. button? Is it the right bumper? The jumbo set on the field. Keeps it here. Out to the left. Good throw. Good catch. And the receiver fights through to pick up the I'm an idiot. I had an amazing game other than the, all these stupid picks. Action passes, especially on first down, because the defense, sometimes they're expecting run. You fake it, easy completion down the field. I'm an idiot. Back at the line after that catch for a first down. There's a lot of extra weight out there for this jumbo set. Play fake. Looks to his left, and there's Cameron. That's a gain of six. When a quarterback can run, he usually takes one guy out of pass coverage. Look at the spy that time on the quarterback. That opens up the passing lanes. Good throw and catch. They load it up now. Bring out the jumbo formation. The Browns take it from the 28. Play fake. Throws to the right. Makes the reception. Yeah!
When you talk about the play action pass game, it's really when you call it. You got to be in a situation where the defense is thinking run. And I run the ball. You have the courage, or I should say the smarts, to fake the run and throw the football. Good call that time by the offense. That long gain sets them up here on this play. Tate's hand at the football. Reynolds in on the tackle. Well, a short gain on the run that time by the offense. When you're a running football team, listen, there's going to be a lot of ugly plays that don't work. You just got to keep running them. Offense lines up here. The Browns will take the snap from the 30. Lewis has got it on the handoff. He'll be taken down about three yards. Kicking a field goal. We're smacking him in the mouth. The Browns call the timeout. They're first. Wow, I'm... An those plays that I tried got picked off. All right, two of them were stupid. We're back, and the offense is ready to roll after oh the timeout. Boy. Let's do it. Set now to attempt the field goal. Drives it through for the field goal. That's a wrap. Man, I was stupid. Ah, oh, I can't believe it. I'm an idiot. You can be smarter with the ball. What a memorable game this truly was. For Phil Simms, Danielle Bellini, and Larry Ridley, Jim Nance saying so long for now, and we leave you with the GMC Never Say Never moment of the game. Three touchdowns, four interceptions. What a moron. All right, finish the game. Wow. Would have been amazing, amazing, amazing if I didn't throw as many interceptions. Or any, obviously. Oh, oh well. We won the game. Wow, the Raiders. Oh my gosh. What is up with our schedule? I'm telling you. Alright. Well, anyway, guys. Once again, thanks for watching. And until next time, I'll see you then. Peace out.